starting up the heater first thing in the morning I take newspaper rolled up about that size I use two of them I simply go down here inside the heater and slide that pe well, first piece of paper all the way to the back and to the left of the heat tunnel of the burn tunnel I then have some incredibly dry crate kindling that I use and I take these pieces and I go down inside the heat the burn tunnel and I lay these pieces of wood up on top of the newspaper Try to lay them up so that they have plenty of air space between each piece of wood and not so as to risk blocking the exit up the heat riser. I also have one little ball of newspaper here that I lay down at the base of the my ember bed, what will become my ember bed, I simply lay up a kind of, you know, kind of a triangle. I'll lay a series of pieces like this up around the newspaper, all the way around the newspaper. So just kind of teepee shape, I guess. Supply of that wood in there. I have to open up the exhaust over here. Forgive me for being outside of the range of the video. And then I take my fr trusty friend the propane torch and holding it like this I get down inside the burn tube I keep it up against the the uh, top of the burn tube ceiling if you want to call it and I keep it hard over here to the right now once again I put my newspaper and paper over to the left of the burn tube and I start my heat flowing over here to the right. This forces heat in, forces heat up through the, chin, uh, the heat riser, and I get a, a draft going. It always works better when you turn the, unit, the safety unit back on. So I'm creating draft here now with this. Then I slowly swing the tip of the flame over towards my newspaper. the wood. And my heater's now going. You can hear it going down in here. Also using the torch, I'll go now and I'll light the other piece of newspaper. That's here. What I find is that once I've got the initial draft going, the initial draft in turn draws on my amp, my ember bed, and the ember bed feeds only partially combusted wood gas over to the hotter part of the fire which is of course up inside the the burn tube and here you will see